My most memorable moment in dental school so far has to be in sim lab and just preparing teeth any which way for the first time, whether it be heart shape, smiley face, anything at all. It, it was that moment that, you know, it was feeling really surreal that, you know, I'm actually becoming a dentist now. I chose to study in dentistry for the opportunity for service. Um, you know, people will always have needs when it comes to healthy living and, you know, healthy teeth is always going to be a part of that. Uh, my story getting into dentistry kind of goes out to anyone else who's pretty much been struggling to get in because um, my story is one about resilience. Uh, I'm a person who have tried uh, through five different dental cycles, uh, application cycles, and I've applied to about 30 schools each time. And it wasn't until the very, very last cycle where I actually finally got interview and had a chance to actually get in. Um, and even before then, I spent a few years just to become a dental hygienist in, in the process. So for anyone looking to get into to this career path, just know that it's definitely gonna be hard, but it will be worth it in the end. I would take the time to, you know, have my emotions, where, whether it be sadness, disappointment, or annoyance, uh, but then have the resilience to continue onward. We'll have our high moments and our low moments, but that's not going to be the end of our story. As long as we have the resilience to continue on, we'll never know how high we can possibly go. You know, if we continue onward, one day we'll look back and realize how much growth we've had thus far. I am CDA proud uh, for the same reason why I got into dentistry and it's because uh, you know CDA has a program called I mean, CDA Cares where we're able to provide free dentistry for a community and it's just a beautiful thing to be a part of.